you this morning. The four SEALs begin what, even for this tough team, will be one very arduous challenge. Everybody who's heard of the challenge that they're undertaking is amazed at their desire to do that and do that for Camp Sunshine. With hundreds waiting at the other end, for nearly seven hours they swam Sebago Lake. In the beginning, we felt really strong, and then at the end, I mean, it just, it was every last bit of energy we had just to get our arms out of the water, and it feels like knives in our shoulders. It's that pain, though, which these guys say pushed them even harder. They say ultimately what they endured on just this one day hardly compares to the anguish the family of some severely sick child faces every day. And I can only imagine what it, what, how hard it is to go through something like this uh, as a family. So this is our little bit to help. This certainly will uh, enable us to bring that many more families that really target the military. Together, these four celebrated SEALs managed to raise nearly $100,000. That's enough money to help send 40 military families to Camp Sunshine next year. And speaking of next year, could these guys be up for an encore? Event like this, you know, right afterwards your body's tired and asks you for rest, but then the next day you're like, I, I want to do that again. So I wouldn't be surprised if this becomes an annual thing.